How's it going everybody? Today I'm going to be showing everyone how to install the shaders mod for 1.6.2. My previous shaders mod video was from for 1.5.2 and it is now outdated and it does not work. Whenever you try to do it, it is uh, it says there is a forge mod not installed or it's missing or whatever. So today I'm going to be showing you how to actually install it because I, without even knowing, uh, it did change from the last time and what you have to do is this will be in the link or this link will be in the description and what you gotta do is you gotta download all these these next three things or four if you want V08 which I believe is another shaders pack but I'm not quite sure what it is the most uh, mostly people want the Rudo plays okay step okay sorry about that I just had a blocker on guess it doesn't let you uh actually do anything yet. So once you download this, you want to click keep. So once that in, uh, loads up, whatever, that is the first thing you need. Then you want to download the shaders core mod. Click. I don't know why my mouse is blinking. Something with Bandicam must make it blink, but whatever. Click. Wait for that. Go download this one. Keep back again leave this page and then you want to just click on the shaders pack uh, and then that one wait for it to load click here and wait another five seconds for it to do its thing click skip add download and you got the shaders all right excuse my desktop it's really messy don't really care but so what you have to do is drag these onto the desktop for now okay and for this first one you double click it the minecraft forge installer and you're gonna get this and you're gonna want to click on the install client it sh should start like that don't mess with anything it will set it to be correct as soon as you open it up click OK it's done and that's it for that and then we can click on to Minecraft and you're gonna want to make a new profile and I'm just going to name it Forge oops and that doesn't really matter and then for the use version you're going to want to scroll down and find the release 1.6.2 Forge and it should be your last one but if it's not just look for that one because that is the one you need and then save profile alright then let's load it up All right. as you can see it does say three mods loaded three mods active alright then just exit it out alright so the next step it's either you can click Windows button R which I find easier or you can click on uh, this and you can type in app percent sign app data percent sign and it'll bring it up to the same thing but either way whatever way you do it doesn't really matter go into minecraft or dot minecraft and you're gonna look for first you're gonna look for mods and these are all from different things those aren't from this so they you shouldn't have anything in this and what you're gonna want to do, so I'll just delete these because I don't I don't have those. Just drag in the shaders mod. And then you are going to look for shaders packs. If you don't have this folder, um I don't I think you can just if you make one that is named shaders pack, I think you should have it though. I'm not sure, 100% sure, because I think it if you've had the shaders mod before, it should be in there, but if it's if you haven't I'm sorry because I, I don't know you might want to just Google search it if and if I if I remember to I will just uh, that put in the description what to do or if anyone comments about it I'll do my best to help you so I'll be right back all right sorry about that but now that is all you have to do that is the that is it it's much easier than last time even though you didn't really have to do anything for last time thing is for for this you have to if you would like uh, Optifine 
which I'm probably going to want if I actually use this. Um, I'm going to have to install it separately. But as you can see, let's just change this back to default. Uh, you can see you've got a shaders. You can select your uh, that. You can select Rudos or whatever you want. Let's go into a single player world. Uh, let's go on to my hardcore world, just like my first video. So once it loads in, as you can see, we get shaders. Um, now it may be smoother for other people. As you can see, I'm not running the smoothest, but uh, it it works all fine. There's some things that are, you know, different. As you can see, the sky is kind of like glitching. I don't know why that's happening, but it's most likely because I'm recording. Okay, a little bit uh, after recording narration. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, if it helped you, please just leave a like, uh, subscribe if you'd like to see. I will try to comment everyone's post if they need help. And uh, yeah, thank you for watching. Hope this helped. Goodbye.